Hi, I'm Susan Berkeley from GreatVoice.com, and here's another voiceover training video from Inside VoiceOver. And we're doing a series here on the voiceover niche markets, and this week we're going to focus in on a niche you probably haven't thought a lot about. It's called telephony, also known as voice prompts, or IVR, which stands for Interactive Voice Response. Now, this is a niche you probably have dealt with, maybe even today. It's the niche where you call a company and you get a voice, maybe even my voice, or could be yours in the future, walking you through voice prompts for this press one, for that press two, and on and on and on. But it's a lot more than that. For example, I do a lot of work, not just for banks, but for financial institutions and for customer service applications, like for Home Depot and Sears. There are thousands and thousands and tens of thousands of voice prompts in these large telephone systems. We're not talking just a simple voicemail. So although you might be paid a few hundred dollars per each job, those customers come back again and again and again. And over the years, this can really, really add up because your voice becomes the branded voice of their company and it's embedded in all of those systems. And I've built a, a whole production company. I've been working 20 years in this niche. and. Uh, we've done extremely, extremely well, so don't overlook it. Now, it's a little bit different than doing commercials or narrations, which I also do. Those are shorter scripts, and they require actually acting and, and uh, you know, real voiceover chops. When you're doing interactive voice response, you become a persona. You're part of the branding of the company. So generally, they want a warm, friendly sound, and they want your speech to be nice and clear, and you have to be very consistent. You, your energy level has to match, and and you know the the work can be there can be quite a, a the sessions can be quite long and sometimes tedious when you're recording voice prompt after voice prompt all kinds of numbers and short phrases which they then edit together so you have to have a lot of patience you have to have a lot of stamina to do this type of work if you've got good audio quality, that's also very, very important. So I just wanted to introduce you to an area of voiceover you might not have thought of. It's called the telephony niche, and it's a big one in the voiceover niche markets. I'm Susan Berkeley. I'll be back next week with more Inside VoiceOver.